Okay, so the one, four, five chord progression is in literally thousands of songs. And uh, the reason they call it a one, four, five is because regardless of what the notes are, whether it's a, a B, E to F sharp, or D to G to A, or, uh, you know, F sharp to B to C sharp, you know, all that stuff seems all unconnected, but it's all just a one, four, five, and it's all the same, it sounds the same, with the exception that it's in a different key. So how, what's an easy way to find this on the guitar? If we locate the one here on the low E string, like say here on your, from your G chord, there's the G down low, the four is right down on the next string right next to it, there's your C, and then D is just up two frets from there. D, so I got one, four, five. Do the same thing in A, starting on the A here at the fifth fret. One, four, five. Or we could start really anywhere, all the way up, how about up at the C? One, four, five. Now we could also get the C down here and do the same thing, starting on this C here. Move it over to the next string, four, five. But as you were doing, instead of moving higher for the four, C to F, C, D, E, F, G, right, one, two, three, four, five. We can also move to, we can, from the C, we can move down to the F, and that's the low, low F instead of the higher F. So C to F, or C to F. So two options with that, one, four, five, or one, four, five. It's the exact same thing, and then we can turn that all into bar, power chords bar chords, or even just as open chords, and, and geez, haven't we heard that kind of a chord progression, those chords move together in all kinds of stuff, you know, so so that's why they call it a 1-4-5, because then it, it, it's, it's obvious that it's just the same thing again, you know, and if we have to name the chords every time, it somehow seems unconnected. So that's a, a good, real good thing to be aware of as you're learning these songs, because you've got a good ear, try to think about, hey, which numbers am I playing? And then you're gonna see uh, some similarities between all kinds of different songs. Okay, check that out, we'll see you soon.